Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Alex the Explainer, and today it's False Hunting in the Winter 3, Part 2. It's the third installment of my False Hunting in the Winter series, kind of, or kind of every year. I go False Hunting in the Winter. This third installment actually has been the two parts. One, the most important find I found, and the second one is a bunch of other interesting finds I found. Actually, in the forest. I actually have some real footage of the forest. Pretty, pretty cool. So, here it is. See, those are trees with thorns. The thorn trees are really, were very uh, abundant during the Ice Age and Pleistocene. Because the mammoths and mastodons, or only the mastodons, because they were the only ones feeding on trees, they actually helped disperse the seeds of the honey locust trees and many other trees of thorns and by eating the fruit and the actually allowing the seeds to fall down and disperse a very large mile. And so it was very helpful for such trees. But now there's not much uh, things helping these trees to help disperse their leaves. Here's something really cool. There's actually this smaller plant right here, and it's actually wrapping around this other plant as they're trying to both reach sunlight. Pretty interesting. Well, I found a real cool shell. Probably from a snail or a squid, maybe even some type of arthropod, but still, that looks really, really cool. A bunch of other fossils over here. Really, really cool. Now, what is that? Um, I'm not really sure what that is. It looks like an egg sac for a spider, maybe. Interesting. Look! Deer tracks. Probably somewhere out here in the forest. I've seen them before here. It's a really cool area. They have a uh, looks to be something uh, on the along the line of a comedont and some horn corals and some other stuff. Really cool area. So here is some really interesting showcase of some fungus. The fungus are growing here to feed on the dead matter to feed on the, the decaying, dead and decaying matter of this log right here. Really cool. Look at this beautiful landscape. It's quite wintry. Look at the snow. Although El Nino, the process known as El Nino, may be making things a little warm here, still, you know, it still looks very wintry. Quite nice. So have you uh, enjoyed those various findings from the forest while fossil hunting in the winter for a third time. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Maybe even learned something. I don't know. And so, guys, bye, guys, and stay Shrek-tastic.